I'm Donnie Baker and today I'm at Tri-County Lanes and I'm going to show you how to bow a 300. I swear to God I am. The first thing you have to do is rent shoes to go bowling. You have to rent the shoes because it's state law. I'm here joined by Mike who's been here since what year? 2006. Circus 2006. Now notice before and after every game he has to spray the shoes down. I'll let Mike demonstrate. See, he removes the odor and replaces it with secondhand smoke. Give me a hit. This is your basic control panel and it's standard in most bowling alleys now. I mean, back when I started mastering this game, we kept it by hand, just like the Pilgrims. And you don't have to enter your real name. Like, I just put P.S., my initials for Porcasaurus. I swear to God, man, Porcasaurus is going to row his first perfect game. The first thing you have to do to master this game is pick out the right bowling ball. I swear to God. And I probably know more about using alley balls than anybody I know of. I was a full-time sub for six years. And there's a lot of money on this rack today. Look at these. Some of them are name brand. Battle Zone. Inferno. Storm. See, it's a fact of life that all bowling balls and slow pitch softball bats basically have the same names. They're either named after hurricanes or racehorses. But there are balls just for women, like this one. Gyno balanced. I had to take Angel Skinner's to the gyno once. It was right after we did it, so I knew there was damage. He put it up on that vage rack, and this was circus 1994. There were three stirrups in, two for her feet and one for her shame. That doctor took one look up under and he's like, oh shit, it's totaled. I swear to God he did. She got mad at me and blamed me. I said, you know what, that's why you're supposed to get three estimates, Angel. Everybody knows it. The first thing you want to do is scan the lanes and kind of read the wood. Always go against the grain. And you count these lanes by boards the same way you measure horses. I swear to God, I'm going to go two boards inside the right arrow and throw the perfect hook right at that head pin. And if I'm in a pissed off mood, I'll go Brooklyn. That means you hit the 10 pin first to knock them down backwards. First thing you have to do is make sure you get a good grip on your shoes. You don't want to be skating all the way down to the head pin. I'm going to give them a good set of brakes. I swear to God. Precious. Right there, baby. Right there. Right in the hole. Okay, I left it a little white, but this is my favorite part. I swear to God. You're about to see a baby be born. I'm Donnie Baker, the bastard maker. It's a girl! You can see the ball return here is a little different. This ain't your standard ball return. This is a framework from a 96 Topaz. I swear to God. But it's still good and it's been welded to work perfect. And look, here's the best part down here. I got wooden cup holders. Guaranteed to get you a 300. Hawker on a shocker. I swear to God. I got moves like Jaggers. Here we are at the beer frame. I swear to God, like Lawrence Taylor said, this is why we lift all them weights. Even though it's bowling, I like to conduct my own halftime interviews. Kind of keeps me focused. Donnie, you're perfect through seven frames. What's been the key to your success? Well, I'm basically clutch. I'm basically as clutch as it gets. I've got still blood in my veins. I'm like one of them piranhas that way. And the other key is, I don't get nervous during the tense moments. I'm like Kurt Schillings. I keep a bloody sock in my underwear. There's so many distractions when you got a perfect game going. Shit-ass kids over there trying to average 84. And look, the whole prize chest just calling my name, but I need to concentrate. Even though I know five more strikes, I could have all this. Beer frames are my favorite, I swear to God. And I don't hog it neither, I share. Because I believe in this sport, me, my hand, and this ball are all one and the same. It's no different than an eighth grade hayride, I swear to God. And guess what? Galaxy's getting her treat right now. Here you go, baby. 
take it, baby. Take it. She burped. She can't hold her mud. I used to do Angel Skinner on these ball returns. I swear to God, it's called a Donnie Baker double header. She loved it. She'd get nine pounds from the front, ten from the back. I swear to God, she would. Ball maintenance is also most important when you have a perfect game going. I swear to God. That's why I bring these. They're Crown Royal bags. I never throw these away. For two years in the winter, I had to wear these as rubbers. Ask Angel Skinner. She said it still smells like spare change. But the clean ones, I used to rub my balls down with. Galaxy's getting a full mill jacket today. I swear to God she is. Look at that. We have thousands of these. My mom Phyllis used to hang these up at the chimney for Christmas. I didn't know who was coming, Santa Claus or Prince. You know, it's a good bowling alley when they give you options to take out your anger. There's a pool table. I'd love to carve that thing up. And here's an arcade. And the lights ain't on. <laughs> swear to God. You know the games are good when the whole room smells like stinky pinky. I knew when I got the fourth strike in a row, and a lot of people don't know this, but that's called a pregnant turkey. And I swear to God it is. I knew at that point that I had it made. And I was like, like when you have a no hitter, you don't want to talk nothing about it. I just use my silence and my focus. My, I hope we get rings again this year. It's about my 14th, 500, 300. And, and I love perfect games. But thank you, I can't sign right now. There's all kinds of different bowling options. League play, Tuesday night trios, open lanes, all of it. But this is my favorite. When everybody else is on beer frame, I do what I call Donnie Baker's hillbilly jackpot. I can sniff it out. I swear to God, I knew camo didn't work. I got moves like Jaggers. Another good day at Tri-County Lanes. I've mastered the game that I fell in love with years ago. I swear to God. Now it's time to relieve some more pressure. Got the key to the spare bathroom. I take this shit serious here. 